these are a significant that Walmart are carrying. Uh, Easy Shield is $29.96 and it, it also comes with stop leaks which is what we need. Um, it's $29.96 and the net weight is 18 ounce. Next to it is AC Pro and it is for R134A and the net weight is 20 ounce and the price is a little higher is $38.23. And it also uh, had leak sealer. I think all of them do now, which is good. They don't have any dye though. So, and this one, Arctic Freeze, synthetic feature in R134A. It also has stop leaks, 22 hours. So it's 32.97 versus. Uh, 38.23 so look like did this might be a better deal Arctic freeze and the dial look like this upside down sorry so if I want to buy probably get Arctic during freeze and it's only one left meaning that a lot of people bought this now if you want a smaller can they have smaller cans here uh, Arctic freeze 12 hours can 12 uh, 1644 now this one is very interesting is also come with UV dye to detect air conditioner leaks and also have stop leaks they all do have stop leaks yeah all of them do and it's 1896 it's 10.25 ounce um, the next one is what brand is this high mileage leak sealer this one is 1944 by ID Hang on. What brand is this? for high mileage cars EC shield 12 hours stop leaks 1996 AC Pro 12 hours 2096 it also have stop leaks um, now if you need to seal your AC system no tools required AC Pro has 3344 super seal I haven't used this product yet but you know if you need to seal your system instead of taking it to you know a specialist you want to save money maybe you can try this first um, before you go to a specialized AC place and lastly is AC Pro 12 hours 2476 right here they all stop leaks which is good so here you go that's what mama is carrying right now and thank you for watching and that I have to point out is that I think all of this can have you have to put put down ten dollar refundable deposit and then once you done with it or empty the can you bring it back I think within 90 days based on California you can check more information at um, richardac.com but uh, I talked to the lady here and just bring uh, bring back the empty can to Walmart and then they'll give you ten dollars with the receipt and then they'll give you ten dollar uh, deposit back okay so that's so you got to pay ten dollar extra for the uh, deposit and then just bring it back and they'll give you back the money hope that helps